Hello everyone and welcome to Prophecy File Briefing. I'm glad that you've joined me today, especially in this brand new year. As we have a future that is ahead of us that God has already planned, I trust that you're seeking the face of God. And you'll take an opportunity as well to join us for a month-long revival right here at Pace Assembly. We would love to have you join us. And we would look forward to hearing from you as soon as possible. Hey, let me share something with you very quickly on this Prophecy Vile briefing today because all things in Bible prophecy begin and end with the nation of Israel. And as you're seeing what's taking place, uh, the Prime Minister has already said that this war is going to continue uh, to be protracted into the months that are to come. I find it very interesting uh, that on the very first day, according to this article, some 20 rockets at midnight of the changing of a brand new year this is the entrance of Israel. 20 rockets are fired towards central Israel as 2024 begins. Friends, this is not something that's going to go away soon. And um, as a matter of fact, it's going to continue to escalate into the future because the Bible says that it's going to. So all things beginning and ending with Israel uh, is literally what you find contained in the, in the Scripture concerning Bible prophecy. In the book of Genesis, the Bible says that God made a covenant with Abraham in Genesis uh, that they would be the ones that would possess the land, the nation of Israel, and their descendants, his descendants, would take uh, that authority as well. You find that in the book of Genesis chapter number 12. That covenant is something that God said would be perpetuated. And everything about this war currently, and as it has been the attacks of the nation of Israel and the Jewish people for so many years, it's all about the land, and it's all about driving the Jewish people into the sea as, the, as they are chanting in the cities of America and around the world. But the Bible is clear in Bible prophecy that God has promised by covenant the land to the nation of Israel, and they will never be driven out of that land again. That is so critical. As we're beginning this brand new year, whatever you do, this is my admonition to you in Bible prophecy, keep your eyes on Israel. As Israel is going, you're going to see the shifting and the changing that's taking place around our world with nations and even the United States and its position with Israel. Keep your eyes on what's taking place right there. It is God's time clock, the nation of Israel and the Jewish people. And pray for the peace of Jerusalem. Thank you for joining me today. I look forward to being back with you again. Till then, remember Jesus Christ is coming soon.